I'm here with uh, David Yellowhorse, and uh, this is, is this your first time at a ninth event? Yes, it's the first time here in Rogers. Uh, now, you work with silver and semi-precious stone to create themes and knife handles. Right. Uh, how did you learn to work with these materials? What happened uh, in 78, I cracked the handle on one of my own knives, and uh, I used uh, just some scrap materials I had on my desk, and ended up putting in a, in a knife, and that intrigued me. Uh, uh, and it uh, opened up a whole new door as far as my artwork is concerned, what I like to do with the, the different materials and stoneworks. And initially was uh, uh, learned from my father and, uh, and an uncle. Can you talk about what Mr. Harris is doing with uh, Yellow Horse Collectibles? Uh, yes, Mr. Harris is, in a short time has become a, um, a, a large dealer of, of a lot of my artwork. He's interested in not only my modern work, but also past work uh, uh, of the past when I was uh, maybe 20, 30 years ago. So uh, uh, you can see that in some of his, his, his uh, a collection of, of the works that he sells. Uh, he loves collecting it, he loves learning about it, and um, uh, he's uh, uh, become quite fascinated with, uh, with, with the work that I do. And, now, is this one of the knives you've uh, you've yeah, done for him? Yeah, this this particular one is a knife I did in oh, about 19, I'd say about 1989. Uh, I, I sold these through the Buck Knife Company in that in that time frame. Did quite a number of them. The blade was uh, designed uh, uh, a design that uh, uh, was given to us uh, by a, a, a knife maker. His name was Bill Cheatham. Yeah, and uh, he does a really nice job with the, uh, it matched my work really well as well. And your knife handles all have a theme. Sometimes uh, you create a uh, theme for a series of them. Yes. Uh, where do you come up with the ideas for these? Uh, my themes uh, very, I follow very close to uh, uh, my heritage, my Navajo heritage, and things that are around my everyday life and that's that's the themes that I use, the things that I'm familiar with and 